a special meteor hit the atmosphere of the Earth a long time ago. The meteor fell into pieces and its crystals were lost. Our grandfather found two of these crystals and discovered that they had special effects on horses. The crystals give special abilities to horses, he said, but nobody believed him. The scholars laughed at him and expelled him. He gave those two crystals to us, hoping that we would be able to realize his dreams. And here we are! This is a horse game. Secret of the Magic Crystals and I kind of ish accidentally bought it and it's like, I don't know, weird fun in a way because I don't, I don't guess I don't normally play horse games but this was fun so I thought hey why not let's play it and you can actually win this game according to a Steam achievement but I'm not sure how you do that yet. I'm not sure how you gather the magic crystals. If you, f if you find the rainbow, you get 100 gold. We have money and we have different houses here. And it wants us to go to the stable because... We have... A horse here and I'm not even gonna bother giving it a funny name. I'm just gonna call it Lindsay. I'm actually gonna go check my sound options. Oh, okay, good. Back. Doom. And you see here, she's gonna grow up in 30 seconds. Could do something with a crystal, but we need to collect five crystals first. And I don't know how to do that. Right now, Lindsay is a unicorn. She has some stats. Uh, the stats are useful when you want to um, you want to compete with your horse and you know make money because you win competitions. And this is box number one or whatever. Uh, and I don't know what this bucket is for at all. And we have food and water, which I don't really understand what happens if they do anything with it, but they can eat. And here's our unicorn. And we can groom it in different ways. I don't know what happens if she's... I'm clicking eat. Now she has intelligence. Nothing happens. Okay. So the funny thing here is you can shop and you can custom your customize your horse. And I bought a DLC so I have all these these customizable option stuffs. Look, she can give her a crown. Or flowers in her ears. Or a fashion hat. Yeah, let's go with fashion hat. Let's pretend it's a she. Uh we can give her glasses. Oh my gosh. The fashionista. I don't know what color. Um, nah, let's go with no glasses. So I mean, this is one of the definitely probably the the fun part of the game. It's just putting crabs on their backs or lemon slices or pink wings or a strawberry. You can make them... You can make them kind of Halloween. Oh yeah, and there's no normal horses. There's unicorns, ice steed, dark steed, fire steed, and pegasus. And we're gonna try to get all those different ones. Um... You know what? I'll just give you a strawberry because that's awesome. Or weird, rather. Do you like stars? Or Celtic decor? Rainbows! I don't know. It feels maybe the leaves. Yeah. Tail. You can have all the fun stuffs. I usually go with. You can have a muffin on the tail. Whee! I usually go with this bow. I'm using all my money now to <laughs> equip the horsey. <clears throat> uh, I know, this is pink, so. You can make it a Christmas horsey! Types of bows or something. Those are hearts. Ah, uh, let's go with these. No, have to be red because that's cool. All right, so we're done with. Um, we're done with 
done with that. You can buy better troughs and feeders and buckets and they go all the way up to level 5. And they cost $2,000 or gold or whatever. And uh, yeah, the point of the game is finding the magic crystals. I have no idea how to do that. I can breed my horses, get them up in level and stuff, but I don't know how to get the magic crystals. But hopefully we'll figure that out. So here we can check all our horses. Lindsay is not very good at anything. She's red. She doesn't have any magic crystals. She can breed, breed, breed. Every horse can breed once. And she's healthy. Or he, they're kind of gender neutral, these horses. And we have different weathers. Now it's snowing. I'm still not sure about the significance of weather, but it's fun. If you want more horses, you upgrade the well, and that will enable you to have more horses in the stable. Horses cost money to buy, so. So, then we can go to the, uh, let's go to the barn. And this, you see here the other horses. So this is a place where you heal your horses when they get sick. So here you can, or you can give them remedies that temporarily increases some of their attributes. It costs money to find those recipes. And when your horses do quests, they can uh, find ingredients that you need for uh, making these different potions or stuff. And we can also go to the blacksmith, where you can make magic horseshoes and put on your horse. And I think those make you better all the way forever when you have the uh, horseshoes on. They cost a little bit more money to find. And for this you also need ingredients, which you can find when doing quests. I think technically I know one of these already by heart, but we're not going to do that right now. And the stable, and we have the gate. There's an ice horse. The gate where we can... I actually have a DLC, so we can play... We can race multiplayer, or single player races, where you race the horse yourself. Uh, the controls are impossible. We can do quests for the people living in the town here, in the area. And it gives us money, it takes a time duration, and if we do all the quests, they give us extra money because they're so happy. And here, we can do races, and if we win all the cups... Well, if we win a cup, we get money. And if we win all the cups, yeah, we get lots of trophies in the stable, and... It's like, you have a racehorse, and you get a steam achievement. But, uh, yeah. And lastly, we have the coral. Where you can train your horse's stats, except intelligence. I have no idea how you get intelligence up. Maybe that has to do with the crystals. Um, and you see there, we're gonna have a rainbow, so we can get a hundred more dollars. Uh, or gold. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna show you all the mini games for training the horses. Haha. <laughs> and then, when we've done this once, I will skip recording all of this. Isn't that the best horse you've ever seen? That's the strawberry horse! So you use the arrows for the minigames, so you want to click when they're green. And the four different minigames build up different stats, so... And we're walking to the next arrow. This particular minigame is kind of slow. It takes a lot of time. And you can also... I'm just like going through the game right now. <laughs> um... We can upgrade all the buildings, which means that if we have horses on higher level than one, they can access the higher level stuff. So, harder minigames, more quests, um, harder races where you get more money for winning, and stuff. So, 100%, we are so great. Just look at that strawberry. And we have the spirit meter, I think, and that is some kind of exhaustion meter, I think. Oh, okay, so we'll go out to the farm and just catch the rainbow. Catch the rainbow! It's usually here. Yeah, you see a rainbow there. Oh, I got it. If we do another minigame, we're gonna miss the next rainbow, I think, but... Yeah, okay, she's a little red. But we got a hundred dollars. Um, okay, let's do another minigame. Let's do this one. I think spirit actually goes up if you don't do not do anything. And if you go to the stable and groom the, your horse, it goes up even faster. So. That's speed and dynamic reflexes. This, this one. I kind of like this horse. 
This is awesome. I don't know where the strawberry comes from, what logic that is, but the hat. You can make a Christmas horse and I guess a Halloween horse. You can get, I guess, the dark horse and make it Halloween. There's a witch's hat. There's top hats. There's all sorts of stuff. Which is cool. But to get all of, all of the um, things to dress your horse up with, you have to buy the DLC. There are only two little DLCs out, so... All the minigames. <clears throat> oh, okay, so on level one they're kinda short. Which is good for recording. Because I won't record them on the higher levels. Maybe level five, but yeah. So now... Oh, look at that. We want to get up to 100, or over 100. Then she, we can compete in the uh, save, actually. Yeah, there's my... Uh, we can compete and win some races, and uh, we want to breed them with high, with the high stats, because then I think their babies will have high stats to begin with. And now we can groom our horsies with all the glitters. You see the meters there are going up. Uh, stamina, no, Not actually. <clears throat> uh, I'll check what those are. Are whoops, come on. Condition and spirit. I think that if condition goes down a lot, your horses get sick if they do quests and stuff like that. But uh, we'll go do. Well, maybe you should wait for the rainbow. We'll go wait for the rainbow. And uh, getting this uh, clover that is sometimes on the map that gives you extra luck when competing in. Um, Races of the gate. That was what I wanted to say. I don't know if the different weathers affect different horses or something. Okay, music is starting to feel pretty. Starting to feel a little loud. It probably isn't. I thought I did audio checks, but anyways. <gasps> Look at the rainbow. Let's see if the rainbow. <gasps> rainbow. Okay. Hundred gold. Alright, so we'll do all the different mini games here. This one is obstacle course, strength, and reflexes. And if you have this game on Steam, there are achievements and there are collectible cards. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go do the, all the races and stuff too, but yeah. Whee! Come on, horsey! I don't even remember your name, but it's kind of immaterial because when they breed it once, I don't know, you don't really do much more with them. And to breed two horses, you need an extra box to put the bowl in. And uh, yeah, they take up a lot of space, the level one horses, after you breed it them once, so <laughs> I sell them. Therefore, I don't really care about their names. <laughs> level five horse. Then it starts getting interesting. I never had a level 5 horse, actually. I played with myself, I got to level- I have two horses on level 2. That's that. Because you have to rebreed from level 1. Actually, you can breed a level 1 and a level 2 horse together. I don't know how that works. What level do you get on your horse? Huh. We'll have to check. playing this a couple weekends just for funsies for some that's what weekends are for are for the funsy games the weird ones okay stamina dexterity and speed that's kind of what we need exactly yeah oh i don't didn't even read what that was oops but we're in the snow with our strawberry horse See if we can win this game. Um, but yeah, playing weird games for funsies. 
weekends are all about. Or not weird games, but yeah. Simulations, dramas, other interestingness. I do own the dating visual novel game, whatever. Hato, 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 Hato Boyfriend. Which we could play after this. And I was thinking maybe uh, Long Live the Queen, if you know what game that is. There's more strategy to that, definitely. But uh, yeah, weekend games for the win. We're running in the forest. I don't think the weather can change while you're doing a minigame. That would be cool though. Or seasons, I guess. Oh, the, oh, we didn't get 100. Well, we got 99%. That's okay. We're gonna have all the horsies, and we're gonna... Hmm. I would like better dexterity and stamina. I guess we'll have to do this one again, but... Can't right now. We need more spirit. Whee! Okay, this, so this brush is for... Uh, body. I think this brush is for the hooves. Yeah. She'll actually, uh, help us with this. <laughs> Which is funny in its own way. There you go. And this last one is for the face, I guess? Because it doesn't do- this doesn't spout green glitter anywhere else. <laughs> Any horse people will probably know. Okay, so now we got a heart down there. An orange heart. That means that our Lindsay can breed, but there's no one to breed with because we only have one horse. I'm gonna do go to another mini game, and then we'll go check out the gate with the with the uh, courses and stuff. All right, so Lindsay's back, and now we have above 100 on everything except intelligence because I still don't know how you how you train that. So actually goes to the stable and just get her spirit up. I mean, you can you can buy better brushes, so I guess that makes it faster. But uh, what we're gonna do now is go to the gate again, and we will do some. I don't know what we'll do. Let's do some quests, so we can do. Your neighbor is looking for a house to pull a plow. Horse? Did that say house? Yeah, they're looking for a house to pull the plow. They use houses over here. Mobile houses. No. So we get 30 gold and it will take 40 seconds, so we accept that, horse goes away, the clock is here, and we can go out into the farm, for example, and check out things, but uh, I'm gonna pause. And we're back, one second left, and boom, and then we get here. Turn our quest, and we found an item, so we found some things to make horseshoes from, and we got 30 gold. And she didn't lose that much of her... Um, Spirit and I don't even remember what it was. So we can do another one. We can, so there's a check mark here. Another one is a letter. A letter needs to be carried to the next village. That takes one minute. Uh, but we get 50 uh, gold for that. So let's do that. Whee! Bye bye, Lindsay! Let's return from quest. The strawberry horse. And she found strawberries! Isn't that appropriate? <laughs> and we got 50 gold. I don't... Is she following the mouse? Wait. Is she following the cursor? What? For a little bit. Wow. I... Oh. 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 Okay, this is weird. Oh, I just realized she lost her horn. It is like hat or horn for the unicorn. Aw. Okay. Well, I think we can just do all the quests, basically. There are two quests left. We have the cart. The forester asks you to help him with his brushwood cart, and it's 40 gold, 1 minute, 10 seconds. So we'll see you, Lindsay. Get more strawberries, please. And Lindsay's back. So when we have um, more than one horse... Oh, she got flowers. When we have more than one horse... Um, I mean, when one horse is off on a quest, we can, you know, we can do stuff with the other horses. So there's going to be more management there. So let's do the last one, the milkman. A strong horse should replace the milkman's sick horse to deliver morning milk. That takes 1 minute 40 seconds and we get 60 gold. And we have to be sure that we look at these meters here. So 
because I think it's this meter. If that's very low, then our horse might get sick. So we'll see if Lindsay gets sick, because if she does, then we'll have to check that out, which will be cool in a way. Something else on my window is weird, but okay. Let's go help the milkman, Lindsay. Alright, Lindsay, come back. Oh, we're, we're getting a rainbow soon. <gasps> See, now she's sick. Lindsay has fallen ill. But she has still completed her quest. Found. Oh, she found a lot of herbs. I guess it's a strawberry. We got our 60 gold. And uh, she's sick. But. People you've helped collected 500 gold for you to show their gratitude because we did all the quests. So we get 500 more gold. Let's see, get them there. Do, 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 do. Oh, we have like a thousand gold. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, so we're gonna go to the barn. And, uh, oh no, actually, I want the rainbow first. Then we're gonna go to the barn. <laughs> Sorry, Lindsay. Where's the barn? The barn. And what we do here is we take this stethoscope. Oh, medicine costs 100 gold. Do you wish to buy the medicine? Yes. Let me click this here and click the mouth, the face of the horse. And look at all the sparkles. Oh, Lindsay regained health. So let's go now to the stable and groom her because that makes her happy. And uh, then we're gonna go back to the gate and do the uh, all the um, win all the cups. Hopefully, we do have the clover, so we should have extra luck in doing that. From what I understand, the tutorial is off right now. But if you you can in the settings, options, settings, you can put the tutorial on. That means the tutorial is on. Every time you click something, the tutorial will be up until you. Uh, uh, shut it off again, but it's helpful. So we'll go over here. So we have the first one is fastest horses. So we'll do that. We'll see what that looks like. So you can't click this away, but you get like info about how we're doing. Lindsay quickly claims the inside. <gasps> She's in first place. Lindsay well placed racing along the rail, traveling to backstretch. It's pretty fast here. Lindsay outrun Grace. Lindsay's well placed. Lindsay's rated off the pace by Sidero, looming dangerously on the inside. Lindsay's now in the first place. Straight away from the back stretch. Rated off the place by Bianco. Looming dangerously on the inside. Rated off the pace by Agassia. I don't even know what that means. Quickly claims the inside. Rated off the pace by Yulali. Quickly claims the inside. Rated off the pace by Alane. Come to the turn, a tired group of runners. Lindsay is in first place. You can read all of this. Uh, makes it interesting, in a way. Uh, but you can also just click if you don't want to see it. Outran Sidero. Well placed racing on the rail. First place. Well placed racing on the rail. Outran Bianco. Well placed racing on the rail. It's basically the same thing over and over. <laughs> Alright, first still in first place is going well. I think it's speed and stamina, I guess, for here. <gasps> Back stretch. Well placed. Off slowly, fail to keep up while do booming dangerously and still in first place. Uh, Bianco. Tired group of runners. Grace. Claims the inside. Up around Bianco. Oh, and then you get results, and they will go through all 10. So, 10th place, 9th place, Bolondini, Bolondene, Clarice, Yulali, 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 Bianco, 6th place, okay. Agassia at 5, Grace at 4, we're pretty high up. Bowden at 3rd, we have Sidero at 2nd place. And first place is Lindsay! Yeah, we won it! And then after that, you actually get a clock. So you still have to wait. So what you could do is you if you don't if you're not interested in watching all that, you can just click it away, get the timer, and then you will see up in this corner which place you came in if you're paying attention. So and Lindsay's coming back now. And we 
you see here, oh, we won the cup. And for that, we get 50 gold. That's what you get for winning level one cups. You also get money for second and third place, I think. So uh, let's run through the rest of these. So that was Gallop. So next one is weight pulling the area competition of the strongest horses. Let's do that. And I'll just click through and we'll wait until Lindsay comes back. Way go Lindsay go and Lindsay's back oh she won yay good girl I'm just presuming Lindsay is a girl could be a boy I mean these horses are very generic they're very like androgynous or whatever so there are five of these so next is obstacle race the obstacle race of the best horses from the surrounding villages I don't want to watch that. And Lindsay won that too! You're so good, girl! And if the meters go down very much, then they won't... I think they won't participate or something like that. So we're getting lots of money from this, or fairly lots. So we have two left, we're gonna do. That's show jumping and steeplechase. So we have show jumping, the competition of show jumping on an obstacle course. So we'll do that. And she's back and she won that too! Oh my gosh, we have like a super horse! Well, I mean, this is level 1, but yeah. So, let's do the last one and then we'll go look at all her cups in the stable. So we have steeple cheese. Blah! Exactly. Steeple cheese, not steeple cheese. Oh, frankly, she could be... Nah. Ste steeple chase challenge. Easy steeple chase race in the woods. There we go. While she's gone, we can go out and catch the rainbow that's coming up. Which is obviously not interesting to watch, but... Hey, rainbow, come on. And you still have the clock here, so... See, she has a gold... Oh, no, the counter is... Oh, if the horses are gone. Okay, now we know what the counter is. I was wrong. Yay, get that. Uh, so we'll go back in here. Oh, no! Whoa, 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 wait, 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 I wanted that. Oh, come on, I want that. I saw it. No, I. Oh, there he is. Oh, oh, oh. I don't know if that makes any difference at the moment for the race, but maybe. I don't know. Anyways, we got some more goals. In the beginning. Oh, she was just second place. Come on, Lindsay. We need you in first place. On the other hand, now we have that. Let's see if she can do it again. And win it. Yeah. Now we have the clover. <gasps> the clover's gone again. Oh my gosh. By the way, have you noticed that the clock is actually going backwards because the timer is going backwards? I didn't realize that before. That's kind of cool. I did find a new clover. And now she's in fourth place. Okay, so that might be because spirit is low and stuff like that. So we'll just go fix that in the stable. And you see, you can see here that she has all her cups up here. If you have the tutorial on, then you get um, info when mousing over them for exactly which competition is which. But you get five cups up there, so. Uh, you can have that on all your horses if you want. All the breeding. Okay, let's go out, get the, um, catch the rainbow, and go win the steeplechase. So that we want her to win all the competitions, and then we'll try the manual. Uh, races because that is crazy all right let's see if she won oh <gasps> she won your horse won all the first level cups and became a first class racehorse I don't know if that gift actually gives anything or if it's just like hey oh actually it did 200 gold I don't know if you get that for every horse that is a champion I guess anyways I realize it's like a half an hour now, so we'll have to check out these manual races next time, next episode. So this is Lindsay the Strawberry Whore, so we're playing Secret of the Magic Crystals. Thank you all for watching, and you know, we'll see if we can beat this game and all the horses and all the funsies and stuffs. So I'll see you all later.